Oh yeah! It's ah! Because I forgot there was a spinning club there. Fuck! That is a uh, And I just repeated the same fucking mistake. Great job, Brett! No! Let's do that again! <laughs> Another level from the Zelda series that ended up becoming a good water level is the uh, one in Skyward Sword. That one was cool! Because it also played in that, it actually had like reference to an actual ancient Buddhist story called the Spider's Web. Mm, and it was okay. like, ooh! It was cool! Because it had like one area where it was. So, you can tell it was, like, flooded with the Buddhist religion in that one temple. It had two levels. The one that was, like, the upper level that you go into. But you can go to an under level, and it's literally, Whoa, no! like, hell. Oh. For a second it there, I thought I was going to eat it with the spikes on the other end. Nope. Like, it, there's literally a level in that particular temple that acts like a flippin' version of hell. Oh boy. I am dead serious. There's zombies that pop out of nowhere. The water, the, the liquid down there is literally poison. There's dungeon traps everywhere. You are literally trying to escape. It is so freaking trippy and messed up, but it's fittingly awesome. Well, you're, you're the type of person who's more into like horror type stuff. I mean, your daughter likes 2017's It. Not as much comparison. She does get scared of the character. Well, yeah, she. The Pennywise is supposed to be scary as hell, so that doesn't yeah. surprise me. But um, she's the one of the few horror games that actually doesn't scare her is Five Nights at Freddy's. It still baffles me. But that, that but that thing is built on getting people's hearts going. Exactly. Oh, oh no! Oh. <laughs> you would think that a little five-year-old child that uh, would be acting like a huge scaredy cat over a game like that. Nope, not my kid. The exact <laughs> opposite of that. <laughs> in fact, one of my favorite characters is one of the most creepiest characters in the game. <laughs> she, her favorite character is the flippin' marionette, the puppet. Oh. Uh, yeah, is that is that the one that looks like a Joker face? Yes. Okay. That literally comes out of a like a Joker Ow, box. Ow, fucker! Like I was enjoying that ride. Ow! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was certainly a scream. Yes. yes. It was. But yeah, the fact that 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 character is her favorite character, I'm like, child, you baffle me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You baffled me. Of all the characters, you baffled me. Why is this one your favorite? See, hey, that's y'all's child. I know. <laughs> I know. She just baffles me sometimes. But then I'm like, oh, at least she's not going to be like me when I was her age. I was a huge scaredy cat. I kind of was on the same boat, but at the same time... Like, uh, okay, so it's a bit of an odd position. I can hear myself. It's probably... Hang on, it's probably Jasper. Sorry, Joey. It's okay. Oh, God! What? I was crouching! What the hell? Okay. Oh, God. Game is suddenly my lagging. My nephew and niece, they are five and four years old, and they love to nap, and my stepsister... I had to tell me this because I'm the only one in the family that knows video games, so they don't have to. Oh, wow. Oh, is that a thing? Ah! Is this generation started it showing signs and not showing any form of fear? It baffles me. <laughs> but, um. A big example of me being the best example of a huge chicken. Guess what? movie that wasn't even meant to be a horror movie scared me the most what was it jurassic park oh 
<laughs> well, Jurassic Park is m like it's kind of meant to be an action thriller. Yeah, and at that time, I was not into that kind of thriller where monsters would try to eat you. Well, I don't think anybody so, would want to get involved no. with that. <laughs> yeah, no. Especially worse when you're a child who is extremely easily sensitive. I think most kids are. Ah, shit. No, I was worst case scenario. I was worst comparison to some other kids. To be fair, though, so are some adults. Points to self. <laughs> oh. uh, here's the worst thing that made it worse and why I remember. <laughs> <laughs> Tails fucking what? ate it. Oof. <laughs> He's just like, I'm gonna stand right here. <laughs> oh no! No! Now I fucking ate it. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it, I died again. What the Yeah, no, you're right. I have no one to blame but myself. Okay, see, I have a very simple solution to this. What's see, that? You know what you gotta do? You know what you gotta do? What? Stop! Stop stinking! <laughs> what Heartless said too! Look what Heartless said! <laughs> what did he say? Karma's a bi- Yeah, it's a bitch! <laughs> move! 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 Oh my god. Get the fuck moving. Go, 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 go! There are some cases where you can get trapped behind builders that have already closed in, and then you're just like, you're fucked. You're gonna squ You're gonna get smushed. I think, like, the worst case scenario that proved that I was one of those few kids who was, like, the worst scaredy cat. Ah! Oh. oh how many never you, mind. How many, uh, do you guys remember the, uh, the, t the movie, the original Jumanji that was... Like, yes! Like, that movie was fucking intense. Okay. Here's the thing. That one did left a bit of a scar on me. For multiple... For, for multiple reasons. Was it because of the giant bug things? Well, the spiders were terrifying because I already was so scared of giant spiders anyway, so that didn't help. If there was anything the that... Giant plant. The giant what? The giant... Man eating plants was one. Oh yeah, no, that was just like, oh my god, that's fucking traumatizing. You know, the thing that always got to me. And then we had the, the scene with the lion. The lion scene didn't really scare me that much. The scenes that actually creeped me out was first of which were the mosquitoes, the giant uh, mosquitoes that are just flying all over the place. My god, oh god, because those things move so fast and it's hard to keep track of. Yeah. The second of which was when I forgot what Robin's character's name is but as a kid it's when he got sucked into the board game that was freaky as hell oh yeah that one scared me really badly too and then uh, um and here we are sorry for the interruption here we are the worst stage in the fucking game fuck you carnival yeah! night zone <laughs> even retro gamer doesn't want this yeah yep you already see it you already fucking see it this piece of shit and, um, also, uh, another scene that scared me a lot from that movie is when the kids start transforming into a monkey. That, that actually kind of that actually traumatized me. It's, it's, it's difficult to process. Um, when I was a kid, like, I was always asking, like, why did he get that? And they said because he was cheating. I'm like, what did he do to cheat? And then he said out loud, oh, it's because he wanted to roll the dice a couple of times while it wasn't his turn. Oh, I guess yep. I'm not supposed to go that way. I haven't played this game in a while, and I'm already getting my ass kicked by this fucking stage. These things are also irritating. These little pinball things. Oh, God. <laughs> move, cylinders. Move. Um. Monkey! <laughs> um. Okay, going on to the idea of why the, the why I was the worst example of a huge scaredy cat. Right after the movie, when um, my it was after Christmas time. There actually, this was like right during Christmas after the movie was like out. Um, do you guys remember the that they had a board game for it too? Yeah, I actually own it. 
Okay, here's where it leads to the sad part, and I still laugh at myself for this. Uh-huh. I tried to prevent everybody in my family from playing it because I thought it was just like the movie. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's how bad I was! That's how bad of a scaredy cat I was! Watch out, I Jesse. One of the cards is going to show a lion up front. Oh, screw you. <laughs> you play <a> hole. <laughs> <laughs> I have I no regrets. Of course you don't. <laughs> but again, I was like a little kid. I was. I had to be at least like, what? Oh, no. Eight, oh, eight, shit. Shit. Old? Damn it. <laughs> I was like at least six, maybe eight years old when this happened. So I was like, God, thinking back on it, I was like, God dang it, Jesse, you are such a dumb child. <laughs> well, aren't we all kind of dumb ch children and dumb so, adults? Okay, I guess you're not supposed to go there. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's go over here. But yeah, the, that really is like a good example of how bad I was as the scary cat when I was a kid. Oh, Dino Mike. I fucking envy you, dude. I would have loved to have had that kind of board game. Actually, I have a copy, too, but mine is made out of... Oh, that is cool, man! That is That's badass. Cool. I would have loved to have had those. I'd be like, oh, I have the real Jumanji game. <laughs> you are very funny, Spinel. <laughs> now, Spinel is, uh... Spinel has become more of a troll to us. You already given in by responding to him, or her, which whatever the two is. Anyway, uh, oh yeah, that reminds me. I need to strangle Spinel for that boneless joke. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that's kind of, that's kind of my new thing. You want boneless? You lose a bone. Oh my fucking god! I just now saw the sketch that Birch made. Pickle Brett. Yeah, I, I saw it too. <laughs> a pickle Rick. 